racing fuel. Yeah! Alright guys, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go and warm the car up a little bit. Then I'll come back home and uh, yeah, it's time to do a oil change. I mean, this is a last year's oil. So I'm just gonna go for a little drive, come back home, put it on ramps. We'll do a little change on a Hellcat. Oh man, she sounds lovely. <laughs> I love my Dodges. You all wanna walk around? Let's see how clean she is. beautiful out I mean it's already it's 9:30 in the morning and it's already like a 50 degrees so I know some of you guys guys down south 50 degrees put the jacket on man no man look at me I'm in a short sleeve look at this day it's just beautiful out guys okay the oil is nice and hot now let's put her up on the ramps That's always her nerve breaking. But hey, what are you gonna do? You gotta do what you gotta do, right? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Come on. All right, guys, I let the oil drain underneath the car there. I'm not gonna go under there and show you we gotta undo this. I mean, it's really, <laughs> it's, it's really nothing to change the oil on these cars. You gotta take out the uh, splash guard, I think they call it. That, it's a four little bolts, 10 millimeter. You take that out. And then you undo the plug, 13 millimeters, let it drain. You undo the filter. Put the filter back on. Put the plug back in. Put the guard back on. Fill it up with oil, you're done. I mean, simple is that. I know some of you guys are gonna be like, why are you doing it yourself? Just take it into the dealer, you know, and it's gonna cost you just about the same. But see, to me guys, owning this car is not about it's not about that, it's more than that just to drive it, you know what I'm saying? I mean, don't get me wrong, I like, wrong, I like to drive it, but... Also, this is a part of the experience, you know, owning uh, cars like this, to take care of it, you know, to wash it yourself, to put a coat of wax on it, to change the oil, just a regular maintenance, you know, I enjoy having it, you know what I'm saying? I was the same thing when I used to own the Harley, you know? change the primary fluids, motor fu fluid, trans fluid. I was doing it all myself just because I, I like doing it. That's the part of the ownership, you know what I'm saying? And uh, what kind of oil I'm gonna use? I use what is recommended. I mean, see the, the pens oil, I don't know if they designed this oil for the car. You know what I'm saying? For these motors, SRT motors, or they just, bond it together to sell more oil but i don't care what they did 
if it's good enough if it's good enough for a Chrysler to warranty my car with a 60,000 miles and tell me use that oil um, it's good enough for me you know what I'm saying that's what they recommend that's what I'm gonna use and I also use this filter right here Mopar original filter you know um, that's what they recommend I used before that white filter which is a high flow filter for a wiper but uh, from what I read online is saying that the filter it's flowing uh, it's a high flow filter and doesn't filter as much but this is the filter that my car came from a factory with right here let's see if you can zoom in that and that's what I'm gonna use and look can we zoom that in it's made in America it's made in America yeah I'm gonna use it that's what the Dutch is recommending that's what I'm gonna use watching I will see you soon with another video have a good one bye bam